Oh, I did hit break. <laughs> wow. Good thing I disabled before. Anyways. Hi. Hi. We play Ace Combat 6. Oh, I completely forgot. I. This is why I don't do early morning streams. Because my brain is scrambled eggs. I forgot to introduce myself. Hello, Ace from Space. Ace, you're now here. And <clears throat> after many, many, ooh, hold on. Ooh, I'm seeing these audio levels and I don't like it. <laughs> Especially that compressor. Let me, let me do something with it. We'll go back to like five. Get that. Compression plus ratio. Alright, I should do it. Scuffed morning stream. <laughs> but yeah, we're playing Ace Combat 6 after like months of not having it. Um, no one might be on, so I'm just gonna go for it. We're, we're continuing with the campaign. Let's just jump right in I don't rem it's been so long I don't remember what uh uh difficulty it was I think it was expert or ace Our forces have expanded Estevakia's military forces in Ania will gradually start to diminish each time they suffer a loss in various areas According to intelligence from our Department of National Safety, there's a section where enemy defenses are low, near Salumna Peaks in central Anya. That section of land is an ideal route for our troops to take, in terms of topography and weather as well. We're going to use this route. It's a steep mountain path covered in snow, which is extremely difficult for our ground unit to advance through, and also renders it vulnerable to air attacks. Make sure to cover our ground unit, and if you spot any threats from the sky, eliminate them. If an emergency happens to occur, deal with it in any way you see fit. Once we get past those mountains, we'll be in the center of Anya. Oh, that's it. Okay. <coughs> Let's visit the hangar, see what we can buy. Well... Honestly, I could buy everything. <laughs> yeah, I could really buy everything, but we are a slight purist, which means we'll be going with that 15 E. Do I have all the... Do I have... I do. Okay, cool. We'll just roll with that then. This is like pure air to air. Should I pick? So we are going with are we ready to fly air to air. Planes? Garuda team, time to take off. I would say that it's better to have ESM. And I mostly always start like this anyway. <gasps> so, yeah. Oh, we refuel. Let's close the distance just slowly. There we go. Wow, this preview is choppy. Oh, that that's just for me though, but you know. Just for me. I heard Mobius 1. I legit 
I legit heard Mobius one. Anyways. Oh yeah, that's nice. Now that's how you introduce a squad. There you are. What's up, bud? Let's get in. Let's get into it. There's Snake Pit. Oh, jeez. Yep, we're going. Hey, what's up, B? Morning. And don't expose me. Don't expose my... my name. <laughs> There we go. Oh man, I doing this the first time is very whoosh. Oh, and the preview is kind of like, well, I'm, I'm just not used to this frame rate. There we go. Got him. All right, they're all below. Ooh, one of them. Oh, we're stalling? Ooh, jeez. Wow, we're that high up, huh? To be part of the... Uh, you and your B jokes. But legit, though. Um... Target hit. I'm not embarrassed. This is just my stream. Ugh. Ugh. There you go. Oh yeah, I forgot you are in range. There we go. Let's go... Be a little bit closer to our buddy right over here. And we'll play in cockpit mode for max realism. Got him. Watch out! The enemy has a lock on you. Whoa. Shamrock, Fox three. Ooh, they know how to play. Uh, let's get some distance. There's a bandit tailing you. Break off. Yep, I know. Get out of here with that. You better get off my boy Snake Bit. That's <laughs> right. Oh, yep. Gotta help my boy out. But first, let's get this Rafal. Really? Alright. Have another. And there we go. There we go. Shamrock, what the hell? I trusted you with this. With this. Oh. Wow, that actually hit. 
<laughs> Sometimes the hitboxes, the hitboxes in this game are like very interesting. I want a gun kill. There we go. Yeah. All right, let's go help out the rest. The rest of our dudes. I'm just not. Well, we want our ground forces. I want our ground forces to, you know, survive. So we're gonna high, we're gonna hightail it over. Oh, I, I didn't even realize them. Yeah, there we go. Plane shaking a little, but nothing we can't handle. At this point, we could just cruise. A lot of A-10s. We don't want... <laughs> A-10s plus ground forces is not a happy time. So go for this little bunch over here. These usually, yeah, these usually take, like, two missiles. In that corner over there. A break, just for realism. At this point, I'd probably pass out. But we exist for speed. We are speed. Oh! I clenched. <laughs> I clenched. I'm not, not proud. I will say it. Whoa. Okay. Another one. New aircraft detected. Approaching Warlock Battalion at high speed. All right, we don't. Man, I am not used to these. I'm not used to these controls. Not too sharp an angle. All right, let's go get those bombers. Should be high and fast, right? I've got lock on. Yeah, I'm looking at the mini map right there. Is that it? No, it's a jammer. Where is it? Ah, there you are. There you are. Woo! Let's let's get a look at this. Look at that thing. Looks like a vampire. <laughs> Anyways. All right, let's go get. Let's clean up one jammer at least. And there we go. Just to clear it up a little bit, you know. And then let's clean up some of these. Clean up some of the secondaries. There we go. We're just cleaning up. Alright, that bomber's getting a little close. Alright, high and fast. Yep. Oh, good job. Just need to find the damn thing. Ah, there you are. 
I can invert. Yeah. Oh! At least I hit it. But my intent was to straight up gun it down. Talisman, we're not done yet. There we go. Uh-huh. Third wave. While it gets a little closer, let's take out some jammers. This one's a little closer. Technically, it's a little closer, but... No, don't need the escorts. Let me just... Destroy it. Oh, this one might miss. Yep. <clears throat> oh, he's flying up. Straight up. Alright, that bomb is getting close. I just need to reorient myself. Here we go. Yeah, it's getting pretty close. There you are. Tried to be, <laughs> at, to my understanding, it the most realistic as possible. But of course, I don't think you're gonna be, you know, you're gonna be doing a firing three, two fox threes, you know. Okay. We're faster. Missile struck target. Come on. Come on. Uh, there we go. Yeah. There we go. I, would, I actually would have wanted to take out just another jammer. Like, just because. The, uh, the doggo sleeping. Oop, drone. I've got something on radar. That's odd. Multiple small objects flying at slow speed through the airspace. Whatever. Small, big, bring them on. Other Jeez, can you, like... Wait a minute. Warning. Cruise Thank you. Incoming. Oop, stalling. Ooh, okay, that's a little close. Damn, my missile did that. Yeah, some of these missiles are wild. All right, watch it. Watch speed. Whoa. That was really close. Are being guided by observation planes. Shoot them down on the attack side. <laughs> we're in the ooh. Range of we're in the Shoot level of a the Yeah, we're near the the uh, the jammers themselves. So let's get away from that. There we go. We got one of them. The target. Let's take Well, I won't say take our time, but let's just be a little bit better. Yeah, they actually do still have jammers. There we go. Another one down. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, yo, that's a lot of red. That is a lot of red from destroyed allies. There we go. That's about three or four, if I remember correctly. Another two. Sheesh. Go ahead, Shamrock. Do your thing. Yeah, we don't want to get hit by those. Those incoming 
missiles can be stopped if you shoot down their observation planes. I know it'd be nice if they didn't go so close to me. Look at all that. Jeez. Once again, I forgot the difficulty with, you know. Yeah, normal, yeah, normal missile ain't gonna do that. You need that, what do you, what you would call it? Ah, oh, jeez. Gotta hit them before they, you know. Woo, yeah, nice. Very nice. Just 10. These guys are unmanned. Yeah. Yeah, we don't want to get hit by that. I only have ten. Ten of my special weapons. Or not even ten, seven of my special weapons left. Yeah, that's the thing. I can't waste can't be wasting them. But that one might hit. <laughs> nope. Oh. Oh, sheesh. Oh, have those planes evacuated yet? Not yet. Evacuation's still not complete. <laughs> Alright, I'm going third person this time. This is getting a little intense. Here we go. About half the observation planes have been destroyed. Keep your guard up. We That's insane. Yeah, on. we need Shamrock to, like, <laughs> get going on him. Okay, well, one more. Five observation craft remaining. Garuda one out of special weapons. There we go. I'm out of wep I'm out of specials. Ow! I didn't think that would hit. You know, you know, there's an achievement to get only gun kills in the campaign. How the hell are you gonna be doing that? I swear, dude. When <laughs> when the drones are like this, how do you do that? Will it hit? It did! Nice. Go get him. Go get him, buddy. I got this one. See, Shamrock is so efficient when it comes to these ver to these specialized individual targets. Seriously, he's so good at destroying them because his <laughs> the his missiles do some like video game bullshit, <laughs> where it it just pulls impossible G's. I I'm in my like earlier playthroughs. When I was younger, I I just see like some wacky angles, wacky turns. There should that should do it. Just yep. one observation craft remaining. One more. Shamrock, you do the honors. God, the special effects are still good to this day. Seriously, they're still so good. All right, I'll wait for it. Okay, it's starting to fire. Get in range. Shamrock should have it, though. There it is. Good job. All operation planes are down. Well Good job, done, buddy. Team. I guess we managed to pull it off. We've got to do something about those missiles, or there won't be a Grace Maria to get back to. Yeah. That's right. Yep. Thanks to your great cover, our troops Nothing were able less. to get through the peaks of Salamna with only minimal damage suffered. But our unit is within range of enemy cruise missile attacks for this mission. We're doing all we can to gather intelligence on the invasion and are mulling strategy options. Wait for the order to come in. Okay, what's the final? All S's. Let's go. 15 drones? There probably were 20. So I killed 15. Nice. I feel so lucky to have met up with Ludmilla. We've okay. been to so many checkpoints. 
I don't know what we would have done without her passport. I don't think I ever would have made it alone. But as we travel through these wide open spaces, enemy troops are few and far between. Actually, we've been on this road for quite some time now, without spotting a single Estovakian military vehicle. Dun, 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 dun. I'm just, I'm just kidding. It looks like our luck has just run out. These men are partisans. A Marian like me. Amaria is a huge country, by the way. Huge country. I can see the fear in her eyes. Also, are those FALs? I tried to I explain to them that Ludmilla is, is no threat. Student. She I is a student from Nordenovic. They are FALs, actually. But I've never Just been much of a liar. Slightly different build. Accent. Don't waste your ammo. Just then, something roars in the sky above. Three A-10s? I know it's our only chance of escape. <laughs> Fighters. Ah, uh, classic jam. On the battlefield, you have to put luck aside and take what you get. Good or bad. <sighs> My fellow countrymen were killed instead of me. Oh my and god, hello Fast and Furious. <laughs> but now I've got to accept the fact that I am the next target. You got to hide that. To dance with the angels. You got to hide that buggy. <laughs> At least it looks like the countryside. Anyways, We save. San Loma. Mission 8. Water. Then I'll give you the lowdown on our mission. Small unmanned aerial vehicles, cruise missiles, and heavy command cruisers are all closely related in terms of functionality. And have been uncovered as the enemy's secret weapons by Look at how many enemies control. there are compared to friends. We have collected missile and small <laughs> unmanned aerial vehicle samples. We're like as well as radar over three. They're over three times their strength. Came up with the following. First of all, the small unmanned aerial vehicles are operated from long distance and approach their intended targets to destroy them. In step two, a special electronic signal inside of each small unmanned aerial vehicle is sent to a cruise missile for guidance. And for the final step, the cruise missile that was guided by a small unmanned aerial vehicle hits and destroys its attack target. That is how the enemy's cruise missile system operates. Small unmanned aerial vehicles and cruise missiles are both launched from the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Once launched, they are operated from the heavy command cruiser via remote control. Our Joint Chiefs of Staff have drawn up a plan to destroy the enemy's missile system based on these analysis results. In order to conquer the heavy command cruiser, a constant barrage of attacks from the air is absolutely indispensable. First, we need to get a springboard to launch our plan of attack. We're about to head south to retake Cavalia Air Force Base in San Loma. Our objective is to retake Cavalia's air facilities, then establish a front line to destroy the enemy's missile system. Once the runway is secured, we should have a decent chance at taking out the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Enemy forces will be heavily deployed from land, air, and sea. We'll be doing all we can to deal with them, but I'm sure they'll be ready for us. Mm -hmm. Success or failure of this mission will very likely have a significant effect on the war. Put everything you've got into this one. You'll see once we're on the map, Cavalia's like... Pretty close to the sea. <laughs> anyway, I'm not sure what to 
bring for this. This is a multi-role mission, but I'm not sure how... Um, you know what? <coughs> Excuse me. Um, hmm. You know what? Talisman. Unguided bombs. Which plane should I pick? I like it. How about my weaponry? Are we ready to fly with these planes? Garuda team, time to take Let's go. Off. Shamrock's always the anti air. Hmm. We take out their ships. They have nothing and they have nothing to defend the city with. Aside from their land forces. Seize San Loma along with its military base and use that as a base of operations for attacking the enemy's heavy command. Let's get a closer cruiser. look at Marigold. Look at that. Look at that ship. That is that is a capital ship. All right, let's go. If you guys don't know me, I'm a sucker for naval warfare. Ooh, this one follows. Bomb. Enemy Perfect. Good hit. Bottom. Now let's go for those air ve air vehicles. They're called planes. <laughs> Watch out. The enemy has a lock on you. There we go. Where are the where are the planes? There you are. Oh, and just one more. One more ship. Woo! Man, they really like... Yeah. They really like me today. The gunfire. Sheesh. Any more ships? Sure. Sure, we'll look we'll at them. It's just a secondary escort fighter, huh? Okay, here's the big boy. Yeah, here they are. What's up? The guy that you're flying into? Anyway, cockpit mode, because I like, I actually like cockpit mode a lot. Ah, where are you? There we go. Corrida 2, enemy chopper down. Chopper? Shamrock, box 2. Ooh. Radar lock. Box 2. Here's... I've got enemy forces on radar. Hardly any, but they're there. Yeah, they are there. There's not a lot of them. It's just four ships. Let's see if I can long range lob. Oh, I just managed to hit. A gun? That's a ship gun. But, you know, dual purpose. Mmm, cruisers can take more than one bomb. Not a destroyer, though. A destroyer can take a missile that actually can't take a missile. It actually cannot take a missile at all. Aegis missiles, though. Those are scary. Enemy Aegis destroyer sunk. Easy, though. Enemy 
Very nice, very nice. <laughs> Look at that graveyard. Now, who to... I guess we'll help Hammerhead. I'll take out their back, a uh, little bit of the back line. Unmanned observation planes confirmed on radar. Be on alert for enemy cruise missiles. What do you want us to do? Shoot down the observation planes or cover our allies? Both. If you can shoot down the unmanned observation planes, that'll minimize the damage to our forces. Yep, no problem. Problem Hammerhead. You're my favorite bomber crew. Because you're the only bomber crew with a name. There we go. Well we'll clean it. We'll clean some up some uh, some of it up. Clean up some of these. Those aren't AA guns, but you know. They're there. So I might as well. Been destroyed. Mm. Oh shit! <laughs> the drones. The drones, man. Well, at least I got a checkpoint. And the checkpoint was completing a Objective C. All right. What we were going to do is help Hammerhead a little bit, a little bit, while uh, getting to um, our ground force. Help them out most of the way. <coughs> you don't want to bomb your own city. It's not preferable. And right there. I'll take out some of the air units too. Yeah. Ooh, that was a close missile. That was a close missile. First wave of enemy cruise missiles incoming. Point of impact is showing up on radar. Stay clear of that area. Loud noises. All right, there we go. Oh, that's a missile headed for me. There we go. All right, we'll we'll take out some escorts and then go. Oh, those aren't escorts. Those aren't escorts. Those are, those are drones. You know what? Help if you stay still. Oh yeah. Oh my. Okay. All right. I guess we're into this now. So, uh, yeah. Enemy plane and gun range. we'll go ahead and take out the, the target aircraft. Ooh, nice. All right, you know what? Let's, let's, let's have Shamrock take a drone out. Watch out. The enemy has a lock on you. There. I'm out running the missiles. No problem. But wow, these. Mm. 
Ooh, give me you. Thank you. Lock on. Watch out. Woo. We've got a lock on you from the ground. This one's mine. Alright, let's bomb some of the AA guns. Anti-aircraft gun destroyed. Enemy reinforcements are on their way. It's a heavily armed LCAC. Hmm. Oh, I guess we're staying with. Uh, uh. Oh, you kidding me? I always deliver, yeah. Alright. Well, we'll have Hammerhead bomb it. We'll go after the hovercraft. Oh, they have missiles? All right. We'll go after this dude. Hey, where you going? Let's go pull up. No. Weird. Oh, now you go hard, right? All right. I see. I see you. This one bomb should have enough blast to take them all. Radar lock. Anti-aircraft gun taken out. There. We'll do one more plane and then go over to uh Missile Hey, they can try to slice, but <laughs> they can't. They're too they're too unskilled. Can I shoot down with the gun? Eh. No need anyway. Ooh, hi, bomber. Ground target has been eliminated. All enemy LCAC confirmed All right. destroyed. The last one is just this damaged AA gun. I'm sure they can, yeah, they can deal with it. I'll let you know, cover, cover, cover. Cause I want them to get, <laughs> I want them to get it. Let's help our, let's help our boys out over here. Oh, avalanches with, okay, good. We'll have, go. Yeah, I want you to get closer. Yeah, get closer. Will it work? Will it hit? Um, the drone might outrun it. Or you could just do that. <laughs> or you can do that. All right, starting to go. Come on. All right, that'll do it. <clears throat> All right, where are you, Warlock? There you are. Wow, you are not much. You are not many. Enemy chopper down. There you go. Chopper's down. V's done. Come on. There we go. I know that's not mission completion. Target number of enemy planes are destroyed. Shift forces to the San Loma takeover operation. Ah, sorry, Warlock. Sorry you couldn't get further. 
But you still have a sizable force. How many, uh, oh, you still have a decent bomber wing hammerhead. Well, maybe it's just those. All right, let's go. Marigold, you have pretty much all of your fleet. Get him. Oh, look at that. Look at that fleet. Look at that fleet. Just do its work. Oh, yeah. Look at that. This. That is why. That is exact. Oh, what, Sam? Roger that. You can count on me. That was completely unnecessary. I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's get some. Let's get some space. Fox two. Enemy tank destroyed. Yeah, Warlock is pretty far. Sad. get you two bombs for you hey yo taking pilots out before takeoff it's bad play but this is war so No, I won't break. I want the drone. Ah, you little. Fine. Fine. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Now. They're you on radar. This one's mine. Enemy kill confirmed. Ooh. Hi. Hi there. Sheesh. Alright, you know what? I'm back off. Let the bombers do their thing. Because they're following me. I have them as support. Might as well use them. Go get them, boys. Can they even reach? Oh, they can. Oh, ow, ow. Damaged. Talisman, you're the key player on this mission. Okay. Don't get shot down. Uh, Anti-aircraft gun destroyed. I'm more concerned about those cruise missiles. There we go. We lost the B-52. I'm not sure if it was by cruise missiles, but. Mm. All right, go get him. Garuda one scored a kill. All targets are almost destroyed. Garuda one, take care of what's left. Talisman, it's time to finish up. God, so many, so many missile. That was really close. Let's clean up. There's not many left, and it's mostly if all air target. So. Enemy kill confirmed. Now, which I had air, uh, air missiles, air to air. I mean, I do, but these are short range missiles. I'm I'm talking about them long range ones. No. 
Eh. <laughs> Hammerhead trying to keep up. It's kind of funny to me. It's always been kind of funny. All right, one more. But I want Rasalka right over here. You fly quick. Typhoon be nimble, Typhoon be quick. It might be a bit of a hassle to take him down. Fire too early. I hit him though. Alright, it's time to pull some ace combat maneuvers. That should have hit. At least, like, a bullet, f one shell from that gun should have hit. Going hard on those afterburners, though. Oh, jeez. Yeah, Rizalka, something else. He built different. But I don't want to prolong this anymore. Oh, got him anyway. Alright, Shamrock. Honors. I am gonna help my boy. Yeah, I'm gonna clean up the, uh, the other stuff. Man, if I have a, if I had a controller cam. All targets are confirmed destroyed. We have taken over the city of San Loma. You can still shoot these guys down. That's the funny part. See? Control of our airport from the Estevakians. The battle for Ameria has just begun. Now that we've accomplished this mission, they did not want to go into the into the bay itself. Excellent job. There's no barrier to entry. Oh well. Game design, I guess. Mission accomplished. We have managed to retake Cavalia Air Force Base and free San Loma in the process. Cavalia will be our chief base of operation for conquering the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Ultimately, the enemy's cruise missile system cannot be stopped unless their heavy command cruiser is destroyed first. Every minute counts for us here. Wait for your next order concerning this operation. All S. My parents would be proud. If only, uh... <laughs> oh yeah, well, see, you know what? Our car has died directly under an aerial battle. At least it looks like a ball of hay. The engine managed to get us this far. But it's been destroyed by machine gun fire. <laughs> this pilot is from Ludmilla's homeland. She asks the crashed pilot about a name asking if he has any information but the pilot takes a turn for the worse just before all this he seemed to be mumbling a name Garuda he's the one that shot me down I know exactly what she's going through, why she's overcome with such emotion. I don't think I've seen those My subs before. Could have very well ended up like this. And now I know. The one she loves is a pilot as well. As we save a man's life on this wide open plane, we both begin to realize what we share, how much we have in common. Mm. We save. Mission nine? This one? <laughs> Oh, man. I'm gonna end with this one. This is an order of deployment. 
We've obtained a portion of classified intelligence concerning the enemy's heavy command cruiser from the Department of National Safety. The heavy command cruiser's official name has been identified as P-1112 Igion. The team consists of a mid-sized Kotos aircraft in charge of electronic warfare and a mid-sized Gyges aircraft in charge of close-range air defense. Igion, the command craft, takes care of all cruise missile-related duties. After acquiring this intelligence, we were able to draw up an operation to destroy the Igion. Listen closely. Fuel is added to the Igion through an opening located in the front. Here's the thing. Multiple tankers must make their way to the front of the Igion for refueling purposes. Once the tankers are positioned in front of the craft to refuel it, the Igion's radar signals are temporarily weakened. This is where it gets important. While the Igion is being refueled, its radar is almost completely unable to detect any type of movement in front of the craft. If you can stay on course and maintain a certain altitude, you could approach the Igion from the air without being noticed by enemy forces. So our best chance of taking that monster out is during its mid-air fuel up. Are you the Igion's sure? flight schedule hmm. is also included in this piece of intelligence. Okay, yeah, that answers my question. We'll the flight route after our meeting in the hangar. Get prepared at once. I was going to say, like, how do they know that it's here in th this part of Anya? And there it goes. Flight schedule. <laughs> uh, we'll keep going with this, but Talisman, full anti air. Should I pick? How about my weaponry? Are we ready to fly with these planes? Garuda team, time to take off. Okay, this is the last mission because this could take a while. This mission can take a while, especially in the higher difficulties. Trigon 2 to Igion. Patrol operation complete. Requesting permission to land. Oh, look at that. Stinger is. I wonder if this I wonder if this design could actually work. Will comply. Lead the way. Copy that. Stay clear of our jet wash. Could it work? And could it Ugh, could such a massive ship um could such a massive ship, you know, land on water, for instance? Maybe the command ship, but it doesn't look like the other craft could. The command cruiser's radar capabilities temporarily falter whenever it's refueling in midair. A lot of good agents lost their lives getting us this intel. <laughs> A lot of Bothans lost their lives to get us this intel. I like that line. They they know. Project Aces knows. I just want to maintain their speed. They're actually flying a little, flying a lot faster than usual. Yeah, about eight, about eight ten ish. So they're they're on it. Approaching target. Nicely modeled island, I think. Wait, is that a crater impact? Or is that a natural formation? I'll maintain altitude, but I can't really maintain airspeed because my trigger finger could get a little unstable. Ooh, the shine. There's the shine of the guy on. Oh, they're arranged that way? Huh. Interesting. We 
go. We're going. Straight up. down you'll be in a world of hurt if you let them go target down keep on that pressure and they'll break soon missile struck target really the array can take three missiles oh hi shamrock what's up Sure. Eat missiles. Ah. Ah. All right, let's hit up. Uh, well, but yeah, let's hit up another. Well, maybe a guy just this time. The, the lethal, the le the lethal stingray. closer for the gun thank you yeah all right cockpit almost in effective range we got this coming at me ooh that's not going to hit yeah i mean i could given Given it's, uh, what do you call it? The hitboxes, the generous hitboxes in this game. I could just stay behind it and gun, but I don't want to do that. I want to do that. Yeah. Uh, where? Oh! Their job is to lead us away. So... There's so much radar, or there's so many contacts on radar that I have to be careful. Yeah, look at all those missiles! I'm just trying to, you know... There we go. Now, the real chore is destroying okay yeah there's still there's still one guy just and down We'll, we'll take care of Strigan team later. Right now, I just want... I just want certain things gone, like the AA guns. Just some of them, though. Just some of them. Can I shoot through the... Kinda, yeah. Ow. Ow. Yeah, their guns hurt. Their guns hurt. All right. We're going to have the we're going to have the time of a lifetime. Watch out. The enemy has a lock on. I'll try spinning. That's a good trick. <laughs> well, I got I got one of them on takeoff. 
But I don't want to get, you know, I don't want to go too far. There we go. Yeah, I don't want to get too far. Head-ons, sure. Let's just gain some speed. Stage one is done. Stage two. <laughs> All these engines. Look how many engines there are, dude. There's a slight, ooh, jeez. There's a slight challenge to this because they have like, they tum t they sometimes like flap up, close the engine, close the engines, you know. Okay, we'll, we'll focus you. All right, you know what? This is getting annoying. Oh, with this support, not much. I know I can do it. Watch out. The enemy has a lock on you. Oh, yeah. All right, let's not go too far away. Alright, that's just one more. We could just do whatever now. We'll have fun. A little bit of fun. Except, the yeah, Agaion has a bunch of Sams that I have no idea where they are. Sometimes, you know, like, they could be weapon systems that don't show up on radar that you could destroy, like on the Gaijas. How's it, how's it feel? How does it feel to have like half the American Air Force on you right now? There we go. They're get they're done. That's it. We can focus on the engines. The yeah, guy on. Is it lowering altitude? I think it is lowering altitude. Huh. Neat little uh. Uh man, this thing. Oh yeah, that's a lot of missiles. Oh yeah, it is slow. It is lower. Yeah, hold on, hold on, talisman. Shamrock, I'm talisman. Let's just, yeah, let's just take away some of the uh, the Sams. That's a nice design from Sams. Though. Very, uh. Very, you know. There. All their. Visible Sams are gone. So. Now it's just head. Now it's just heading things on like in Ace Combat Zero. <laughs> It's a tough cockpit. And I, I'm, I'm gonna say, I like the design of this ship too. It's very nice. Sleek. And I like the, the detail that they have their, uh, 
that they have their flaps down. It's also launching Nimbus. A lot of Nimbus. All right, we got the core. It just did the same thing. This time, we just do all that. It'll be gone. There we go. Their heavy command cruiser has been destroyed. Excellent work. Now it's our turn. <laughs> Back to the sea you go. May you rest in quiet slumber. You know how much money that would have caught that should have yeah, how much money would that have cost <laughs> to make, maintain, arm? Oh. The Ion and its air unit have been destroyed. The cruise missiles aimed at Emeria have also been eliminated. This was a huge victory for us, and I'm sure it'll have a significant impact on the mm. war. Garuda team, you have received a letter of commendation from the Joint Chiefs of Staff for your invaluable service in this mission. Everyone that participated should should have that should have the letter of accommodation Which is basically almost every air unit in the game actually, let's see it. It's me Min shamrock windhover uh, Avalanche Yeah, avalanche and sky kid. I think we're missing one more air unit, which is Stingray, but they're in attack formation, which would not <laughs> They're they're A10s. They they would not bode well. But only A. Only A. Wait, is that a G36? Lieutenant Colonel. This man was once a pupil of mine. Many years have passed since then, but Lieutenant Commander Pasternak still has that same spark of confidence in his eyes he had as a young man. Glad to see you are looking well. He was brought here to help you us too. turn the war in our favor. Now that he has been promoted to captain of the Strigan team, he is sure to be a thorn in the side of the American military. Hmm. Don't leave your baggage. It may be uncomfortable, but keep it hidden behind your back. Huh? Trust me, it is how things are done here. <laughs> I asked him if he knew Garuda won. Know him? <laughs> My sole reason of being sent here was to fight him. He smiled to hide the rage within him. That should have been my passion, my fire. But things have changed. This man is about to step into the world I once knew. My days in the sky are behind me now. The bitter taste of loneliness is all I have left. That'll be it, actually, for the morning stream. I feel like I might just go for a evening stream. So you get a twofer. You get a T for one today. A uh, little bit of Ace Combat 6. Very nice. Um, you know what? We'll do Age of Empires 4 campaign will go to the hundred years of war 
we're doing the campaigns in order, even though I don't want to do them in order. <laughs> English, French, Mongol, Rus. I want to play the la the other two first. And I have gone through like one of the Mongol missions, but that's just one. Just just one. There, it's pretty much blind playthroughs all over for the campaign. So I know short stream only like a little more than an hour, but. I really wanted to bring this back and doing three missions. Doing three missions feels okay. Feels okay. But I also want to save energy for the potential evening stream. We're not going to like do another stream ends until I finish the, you know, whatever campaign. That's going to take <laughs> too much time. Personally. So anyways, uh, thank you for watching. Anyone that has joined in and is still here, or maybe even just, you know, gone. And hello to those who are who may view the VOD. I will see you all this evening. Probably about six. Uh six in the in the evening. Yeah, that'll be about right. We'll be playing the Age of Empires for Hundred Years War campaign. Alright, I'll see you guys then.